Ah, the Moody Blues of the rock band of the 60s and 70s. They've sold over 70 million records around the world and have been awarded an astonishing 14 platinum and gold discs. Have a look. Let's go back to where it all began. Just what the truth is I can't say anymore Cause I love you Well, there you go. One of the anthems uh, of the uh, the pop and rock and roll industry and the boys are going to continue their legacy with the first Australian tour in six years. Justin, John and Graham join us. Hello. Gentlemen, Hi, good morning. Hi, Great to have you back. Nice to be here. Great yeah. to be back. Gee, every time you hear that song, Nights in White Satin, what a powerful song. I couldn't resist downloading the lyrics. I got the lyrics out of here. Nights in White Satin, never reaching the end. Letters I've written, never meaning to send. Now, Justin, you wrote that. Yeah. You were only 19. Yes. What, what, what does it mean? <laughs> There's been a lot of speculation about what it meant. I, I was at the... In, 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 in truth, I was at the end of one big love affair, which is uh, quite important at 19, isn't it? You know. So, and at the beginning of another, and... Um, it was just a lot of thoughts that I put together, and there's kind of a lot of truth in that song that I discover when I sing it almost every night, you know. I do write letters never meaning to send, or emails that I just don't press send on, you know, wait till tomorrow morning. And I think you, th there's another line that says, just what you want to be, you'll be in the end. And I think that's probably true. You do make your own life and your own life story. Mm -hmm. So, um... I, I, you know, it's a wonderful song for us to, to mm. play every night and uh, more than what was in the song, I can't tell. There's a few things that are kind of private about it, but mm. it, it obviously has a meaning for other people too. Oh, and yeah, indeed, everybody mm. has a different I view. must say, that just one, one, one last thing, there's a, there's a version by a lady called Betty Lavette that she made last year that mm. is absolutely stunning and I heard mm. the song for the first time in a different way. Just, uh, just recently. It's Interesting really that you great. appreciate somebody singer. else's interpretation. Yeah, yeah. Do you all sleep in satin sheets? That's what we want to know. <laughs> <laughs> Hugely un impractical with a beard growth like mine. Yes, and Graham's, yes. <laughs> um, you did sell the rights to Lonnie Donegan, I understand. No, I signed a... Uh, I signed rather a stupid publishing company when mm. I was... like A uh, publishing deal when I was about 17. Wow. But so did a lot of people. You know, mm. even the Beatles, I mean... Mm. Uh, you know, uh, I guess, is the, that the frustration? They don't own their own songs. I don't own those songs, the copyright, even though I was the writer. Indeed. Um, so, clearly what you know when you're 19 and 20 to, let's fast forward, um, 40 years, uh, what would you, as a 20-year-old, do now? Uh, well, what would you do now that you wish you'd known when you were 20? Ah, uh, that's a difficult one. I've been asked that before, and I'm really... I'd be sh afraid to change anything in case yeah. I didn't end up where I am now, and I'm mm. absolutely delighted where I am now. Fabulous. There's a few rough spots along the way, but that's life, isn't it? You've got to mm. you've got to bounce along the bottom every now and then to know that you're floating. It's called life. Yeah. yeah. No and, and John, you've got to appreciate where you are. You live in fabulous Barbados. You have a great life. You tour the world. Um, Homer Simpson uh, in invited Moody Blues. Yeah. And what year was that? And how chuffed were you to know at the height of the Simpsons, Moody Blues got a Guernsey there? It was just an incredible experience. The wonderful thing was, a bit later on, after the show had been released, was people come up and say, I saw you on the television the other day, and you go, oh, was it, oh, was it good? What, what plant song did we sing? You know? said, no, no, on the Simpsons. You know. <laughs> So, no, it was brilliant. We went into Canada. We did it all by ADSL line. Uh, we did all the, vo did all the voiceovers from there. And it was just brilliant. And, and be part of the Simpsons family because, they, you know, they give you the jacket. And then every new character or every new series, they send you a new badge to put on. and Tell you where to put it. Per tell you exactly where to put it on the... On so the, the ongoing wardrobe. Oh, yes, on, on, yeah. it's I wonderful. asked my, my daughter, was at UCLA when that was first shown, mm. and um, uh, she phoned me up. She said, I've seen the, your Simpsons episode that you're in, because we didn't know the script. Matt Gronick only gave us the bits that we were in. And I said, oh, great. What do I look like? And she said, yellow. Yellow. <laughs> it's like prime. You each got a primary colour. Colour. <laughs> Not easy being yellow. No, that's right. Yeah. Um, what, what can people expect now from the Moody Blues? Mm. This is your first time, as I mentioned, in six years mm. with the band. Mm. What do we see? What do we experience? Well, I think uh, as the Moody Blues, we're going to play the songs that hopefully 
uh, take the audience know. on a journey. Mm -hmm. Just like in the old days of an album, mm -hmm. we want to take the audience on a journey and at the end of the evening, they've gone away with an, an emotional ride. Are you ever surprised when you look out and you see 20 year olds out there? No, not no. at all. I think the young people that are with us now love the music that we mm. made when, when we were young. And mm. uh, we had a lot of success in the 80s with a couple of big hit mm. singles. And that's the core of our audience now. It's, it's, a, it's great. You know, we're it making up for lost time. We're to touring quality, all the time. quality songs, quality music. I hope so. Uh, mm. Absolutely. Hey, guys, congratulations. Have a fabulous tour. Thank I'm you. so pleased you could join us in the studio again. Thank but you very much. Graham, John, Graham, John and Justin, thank you. The thank Moody you, Blues, yeah. all the intels are on the website as well. Here's something for you.